I'm still gonna have to overcome some prejudice. Um, See you later. See you later. See you later, cause I know you're coming back. What is up, everybody? It is your boy, your best friend, Marcus Knight, here, back with another YouTube video. I'm in my college dorm room. It's not fully set up. So sorry, it looks really bare. Process. Um, but yeah, I came here to talk to you about being black at a PWI. As you know, I do go to Belmont University, a four-year private university. Um, African Americans only make up about 6% of the student population. I wanted to talk about just the experiences that I've had. Um, none of them have been like, oh my gosh, I got racially profiled. Or, it's not that serious, but I just wanted to sit and talk to you about the reality. Um, yes, when I first came here the first couple weeks, I looked around and I spotted out different people of color, specifically black people, to look at, make eye contact with, do the whole thing and just be over with because it's just nice to see somebody that you're, you know, you're connected with culturally. I'm not sure if white people do that. If y'all do, let me know in the comments below. So yeah, I wanted to make sure that I found people who were like me, who were interested in the same things, who listened to the same music, who wore the same clothes. Who... I love Belmont and everyone here is amazing. I don't know what it is about um, Nashville campuses, but everyone just seems so nice, um, at least to me. The reality is there are a majority of white police officers um, at this campus, and even though they've all been amazing, they've all been amazing, no trouble. Um, I mean, me and my friends, we still pay attention. We still do have to be aware. We still have to know like what's going on at all times. It's tense because things like that can happen at any time. And Tennessee is not the most racially progressive state, I feel like. So being black at Belmont really does mean embracing your individuality. We try not to feed into the stereotypes of being the rowdy, loud, you know, black people, but this doesn't help. Look out. Y'all talking about people in the dark. Look out. This is why you can't take black people nowhere. Look at this. Get it, Jasmine. intelligent, amazing people. Um, I'm just so excited to get to see uh, them and make some new BSA family as well. I think that's gonna be amazing. We love cookouts. We love going to church every Sunday. We love soul food. We love Black Panther. I mean, I mean, we really embrace it here. Um, and yes, there's been microaggressions before. Does your hair always look like that? Or is Black Panther your favorite superhero? It's just like little things like that. Um, and especially in the honors program, you know, being in certain classes, you know, a lot of people don't expect me to have a valid opinion or um, to get an answer right or anything like that. Like they, they're not too pretentious, but you know, there's always that person. I'm not saying everybody is bad, but you know, there's that person. Um, 
I'm still going to have to overcome some prejudice. Um, but, I mean, it's nothing like what it is in the real world. It's hard to get money for this school, so you know we're doing loans. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked this video at all, please give it a like. Please subscribe right there with the red button. Turn on that bell so you know every single time that I post, which is every single Saturday evening. Um, and thank you so much for watching this. Um, and you know what I always say, and we're still doing it. Join the round table because we're always getting better. Every day, every night. We can make a wildfire get away.